Welcome back guys. Today I have a tutorial for all of you on how to create the berries you will need to finish off your gorgeous floral cards using Susan Tierney Cockburn's Floral Dyes by Spellbinders. Welcome back guys. Today we are, as promised, making the berries that I showed in the video last Thursday. These are the types of berries I'm talking about. They are made with styrofoam balls and the upcoming release of the Spellbinders flower dies are going to have an American holly. So we are going to need red berries. So I have made a whole container of them and I made these to coordinate with the color of my poinsettia that we made in the video last Thursday. If you have not seen that video, I will link it above here. Um, so, but today we're just going to go over the technique of turning these styrofoam balls into berries. So this bag here, I actually picked up at the dollar 25 store. Um, I will have another resource though. If you can't find them, I will link a resource below from Amazon that um, are comparable so that if you can't find them at your dollar store, they're pretty reasonable. I think it's like six bucks. So um, for some reason, you know, that way you at least have a place to go. So if you're interested in doing this. So what you're gonna need is you're gonna need a styrofoam or paper plate, a baggie, I recommend gloves. <laughs> and some sort of alcohol ink. This one here happens to be Tim Holtz alcohol ink by Ranger. You can use your Copic refills, you can use Spectrum Nor refills, you can, I mean, any kind of alcohol ink that you have, any brand. So alcohol ink dries really, really fast and it's permanent. So both of those help this technique a lot. So before I begin, well, I can go ahead and put these in here before I put the, Thing. These are very staticky, and, and I'm sorry for the noise. I know this is going to make some noise on camera. Okay, I am going to go ahead and seal my bag up, because heaven forbid, should we have an accident in this bag, open. So that's what I put the clip on there. Okay, so I'm going to get all these down to the bottom of the baggie. Most of them, anyways. Get my gloves on. And it's actually not that messy. I mean, I, I did one of them without the gloves, and I think I got a little bit of ink on me, but it's really not that messy. Because the alcohol ink dries so fast. Literally, it dries really fast. I mean, look, I did two times, and that's all the ink I got on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, it really isn't that bad. So, now I'm just going to squirt some of this down in there. I don't need that much. And I'm going to just smush this around. Yes, we're making purple berries. I'm just going to squish this around. Pull all these down there. Very, very simple technique. But I just thought I would show you. I learned it from Susan over on her group. Um, this, I'm not sure the name of her group. The Budding Gardeners. Susan Tierney Cockburn's group. She's the designer of the flower dyes at Spellbinders. Super sweet. She designs amazing dies. The new release is on Thursday. I will be having a video on Thursday of my card, which will include the poinsettia that we made together. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And Hit that notification bell so you're notified when that video comes. I will have a um, 
flower making series on my channel, so look for that also. I'll have a playlist, so just look under my playlists. Okay, so now all our berries are purple. Super, super simple. And now you just dump out all of these onto your paper plate. They dry. By the time you get these out on the plate, they're dry already. So, they I mean, they practically dry themselves. They're so... Um, but they're staticky. So... Um, I was really surprised they didn't stick together more, like clump. They actually do just come apart. But they're so staticky. So you do have to work on getting them into your jar or your container. You can just keep them in a Ziploc bag if you want to. But they are quite staticky. So they come out pretty easily, oh, <laughs> but they cling to themselves. They like the bag. They like your hands. And they like each other, but I mean, they will just stick to your hands. So that all that's all there is to it. And see, now I don't have my hand, like I can pick it up and it's not, they're not, they're not staining anything. They are dry. So there you go. That's how easy it is, guys. So now I have purple berries. So I hope this was helpful. I will see you on Thursday, the 10th, for the release. And be watching in the group. Heartfelt Card Making with Spellbinders and more over on Facebook. The link is in the description below um, for an upcoming game. And there will be a prize. So be headed over to Facebook now and join the group to see what's going on. Because we have a lot of fun coming up. Talk to you soon. Bye.